Hey guys, I'm showing you how to get 100% in Grand Theft Auto 5. Uh, these are this is the breakdown here. 50% of it is uh, story missions. 10% of completion is Stranger and Freaks. 10% is hobbies and pastimes. 15% random events, and then 15% of completion is towards miscellaneous activities. Uh, to see your uh, percentage, go to the 100% checklist under stats. Uh, hit start and go to the 100% checklist. And here you can see uh, the total number of missions and everything uh, in. Right now on this uh, screenshot here, I'm at 100%. So I am going to show you exactly what you need to do. And uh, once you've got 100%, you can do fun things like see the UFOs and whatnot. So uh, here's the uh, the story missions. This is, takes uh, uh, is 50% of the total completion. Uh, there's 69 main story missions, and then there are five Lester assassination missions that you must do for a total of 74, and that'll apply, uh, apply to 50% of the total completion. The uh, next uh, thing we're going to look at are Stranger and Freaks, which contributes to 10%, and there's 20 total, and they're all Franklin missions. You don't have to do the Michael or Trevor uh, stranger and freak. So do all the Tanya towing missions, the paparazzo missions, the shift work mission, uh, and then do only Barry and Fanatic uh, missions that apply to Franklin and then Dom, and then you're going to have to do the Omega and Dreyfus, which are collectible sections. Uh, Franklin missions all are the green question marks on the map. Once you've complete the game, you'll have most of them unlocked. Uh, this one here is the Omega mission. Once you talk to him, he'll give you a, a, a quest to go find 50 spaceship parts. You're going to have to go and find all 50 of those space. And here's the location again. You have to find all 50 spaceship parts and then come back here. And here is one of the spaceship parts. I do have a link in the description uh, to a guy that has a complete collectible uh, checklist and video and locations of pictures of all the parts. Uh, this is the, the letter. Uh, these you don't actually talk to someone to uh, initiate the mission once you've got all the scrap letters though There's 50 of them total once you've got them all you'll have a stranger and freaks mission right there on the uh, On that mark and that's uh, and that'll be the last one you'll get probably for uh, the Franklin side mission So the hobbies and pastimes uh, the private lap dance shooting range uh, off-road races You're gonna have to win at tennis uh, play golf even or under par when it darts do the triathlon races uh, warning the last one is about 25 to 30 minutes long and then you're gonna have to do all 12 lessons in the flight school and then do the 13 parachuting missions uh, the obviously the lap dance is in the strip club uh, just go take one of the girls take her into the back and then here's the shooting range and here's the list of them here. You got handguns, submachine guns, assault rifles, shotguns, light machine gun, and heavy weapons. Each one of them has three challenges for a total of 18. You need bronze or better for this. And don't worry about using up ammunition here. It's uh, unlimited. And make sure you go to the, uh, the, the shop with the gun range on it. It'll be located on the map. And then the street races, here's, I got one here on the, on the map. There's five street races total. Again, bronze or better. And there's the location of all five of them. Then you need to do the off-road moto uh, ATV races, and there are four of those. Again, bronze or better. And then you need to get bronze or better on the, uh, on the sea races. Um, and there's four of those. And then uh, you also need to win a game of tennis. There's a few tennis courts around the uh, on the map, but there's one in Michael's backyard. So you can head down there. You just need match. to win. And that's all you need to do for that. And then you need to do, uh, play a round of golf at uh, even score or under uh, for all nine holes. So, for example, a par four, you need to shoot four strokes or less. And that's a, a, the total round score is what counts. So you play ni all nine holes at even par or under. Uh, then you need to uh, win a game of darts. Uh, grab, call up one of your buddies on the phone. Go to that location. 
and go into this uh, little bar here. And in the back corner is the dartboard. And just simply uh, win, a, win a game here. I'm going to play against, uh, I believe it looks like I got Michael here. Uh, the next thing you need to do is win the three triathlon races. That's the first one there. You'll unlock the second one as soon as you beat this. And then uh, unlock the third, the really long one, after you beat the second one. You need, again, bronze or better. So after that, go to the flight school. And here you've got 12 lessons. And you'll, again, need bronze or better. So do all 12 of those. And then you need to do the parachuting. Uh, there's 13 basin heli helicopter jumps. Uh, they are located on the map. If you followed the uh, guide and did all the Franklin missions, uh, you should have these unlocked here. There's, again, 13 of them. And then the, uh, for the random events, that counts, believe it or not, for 15%, you need to complete 14 out of the total 57 events. Uh, what happens when you're driving around, you're going to see little blue or red dots on the map, and one just popped up there, and you can hear some uh, arguing here. Uh, there's four, uh, You need to complete 14 of the 57 of these. And they just randomly pop up. There's really no guide where it'll tell you where each of them are. So as you're driving around, when you see those uh, opportunities, get out and do uh, at least the first 14. And then moving on to the miscellaneous, uh, you need to collect the spaceship parts and letter scraps, which you would have done in the Franklin Freaks and uh, missions, the side missions. So after that, you'll just need to do half of the under the bridges, half of the stun jumps, eight of the 15 knife. Uh, knife flights, purchase five properties, purchase a vehicle from the website, play and uh, fetch with chop, do a booty call, use the prostitute, hold up a store, visit the cinema, and then you're going to complete four friends activities. Those are uh, when you go to your cell phone and dial up uh, Trevor, Michael, or Franklin, and then you go out and uh, go to the bar or go to the theater. So the first uh, thing here, just do half of the stump jumps, uh, jump, stump Stunt jumps. I can't talk today, and that's just one of the uh, one of the fifty total. Uh, Twenty-five to get uh, towards one hundred percent. You will need to get all fifty of them for a trophy or achievement. Uh, same thing with the uh, knife flights. There's uh, fifty of those, and uh, under the bridges. So do the. Uh, Here's uh, one of the under the bridges, one of the many again in the game. That was my ninth one. Again, if you get all 50, there's a trophy and achievement. And uh, then you're going to have to do eight of the 15. I believe I said there was 50 earlier. But there's uh, 15 knife flights. And that's where you turn sideways. And those are all in the Los Santos area. And then you need to purchase five properties. Uh, there's many of them, but just purchase five. Uh, some of them are fairly expensive. There are a couple that are inexpensive. Uh, probably best just to wait until you've completed the game and you'll have plenty of money. And that's just a sample of them there. And then uh, you need to purchase a vehicle. Uh, what you need to do is go to your cell phone, go to the online internet, go to travel transport, and go to the legendary motorsports. Uh, you're going to need to have a garage before you can purchase this. So make sure you have a garage, purchase a garage, select a car, select a color, select order. And that will be it for that miscellaneous uh, activity. And here we're going to play with Chop. Uh, you'll find him at Franklin's house, go into his backyard, hit, uh, I believe it's R1, we'll, we'll make him follow you. Go into your dial wheel to pull up the ball, throw the ball. Chop will go run after it. <laughs> uh, make sure he doesn't get hit by a car. I did that once, and uh, poor Chop got hit by an oncoming car. It was my fault. I felt bad. Thankfully, he didn't die. And uh, moving on from there, you're going to do uh, a, get a booty call, go into the strip club, get a lap dance. You're going to build up your likeness meter uh, with one of the girls. By touching them in the uh, in the uh, lap dance area, at the end you may get lucky enough to get her phone number. 
or rather get an opportunity to take her home, at which point you'll end up with her phone number, and that will complete that. Uh, then you need to rob a store. There's only 19 stores you can rob in the game, so use this location here at the top of Los, Los Santos. There's a 24-hour, 24-7 supermarket here. All you need to do is go in, draw a gun at the uh, clerk behind the counter, uh, wait. Uh, it seemingly takes forever for him to pack up a bag full of money, uh, and then escape the cops, and that'll be that. And then uh, go to the cinema. There's three movie theaters. Uh, just go pick any one of them. Go buy a ticket, and uh, you'll be in the theater, and, and that'll complete that activity. Of course, you can do that with a friend, and you'll need to do four friend missions, so you might as well call a friend to do this. But nonetheless, there we go, the loneliness ro uh, loneliest, uh, robot. And the, the only last thing you got to do is do those four friend missions, if you haven't already. Uh, just our friend activities. You dial up your cell phone, call one of them. And uh, once you've done that, you've, uh, you'll have 100%. You can do fun Easter eggs like going to Mount Chiliad and seeing this UFO or going over the fort and seeing the other one over the hippie camp. There's three UFOs. I do have videos of each of them in my... In, uh, in the description link below. So that's it. And until next time, happy trophy hunting.